Hey y'all, it is Kamira from Kamira's Kitchen and I am so glad to be talking with you guys today. I know y'all do not see me on screen. I don't come on like that. You know, I'm, I'm still working through different insecurities of being on the camera, if I'm being honest. Um, but I did want to come on today and tell you all, thank you so much for subscribing to my channel and supporting me. We're almost at 25,000 subscribers and I honestly never thought that we would be there. Uh, when I started this channel about a year and a half ago, um, I just didn't know where it was going to lead me. And now I have seen so much growth. I've seen people commenting and trying my recipes and telling me they love it. Um, you know, if you're one of those people that subscribes to me, but you're like a silent subscriber, so you don't ever, you know, you don't ever comment, you don't ever come out and, you know, say I'm here. Guys, say you're here, you know, talk to me, okay? <laughs> but I just want to share a little bit about how I started this channel. So, a year, about two years ago, actually, um, one of the women in my Bible study had a baby and the Bible study set up a meal train. If you know what a meal train is, it's essentially just a scheduled time for you to bring meals to a family that, you know, had a baby, went through a life change, something like that. So anyway, I signed up and I brought a meal. I brought a nice meal. I did this African roast chicken. I did this yellow rice, some type of vegetable. And really they had never, we had been friends for a while, but she had never had my cooking. So when she tried it, she just said, this is amazing. Like this is extremely good. I didn't even know you could cook like this. And that same day I was praying and I was in my car and the Lord spoke to me in a soft voice. He said, offer to cook for them. Um, you know, tell them they'll buy the groceries, but you're going to cook for free and you'll do it for a couple weeks. And I thought about it and I said, I am? He's like, yeah, you are. Tell him you will. So I just put it out there. I said, hey, how about, you know, you give me $50 a week for the groceries and I will bring you guys, you know, all types of food for dinner. And of course they were excited and I loved it. I loved it. I didn't get paid to cook for them. Um, I just used that money for the groceries and I would do all sorts of stuff. I had so much fun. I did chicken shawarma. I had chickpea wraps and quinoa and dirty rice and chicken and beef and all just all sorts of stuff that I was just coming up with. And um, through that, this friend encouraged me to share this gift of cooking with the world. And so I prayed about it and she was praying for me and, and I just, you know, the Lord dropped in my spirit to do a YouTube channel. And so that's what I'm doing now. And I share this story to say that, you know, sometimes we don't know exactly where, you know, being obedient to God will lead us. We don't know where it's going to go. I didn't start cooking for them as a way to start a YouTube channel or anything like that, but that's where it led. And so sometimes when you hear that still, when you hear that still small voice, take the step and that is the answer to what you've been praying for, is listening to that voice. And it may not come like you thought. The answer may not be what you thought. It may be something that you didn't suspect he would say, but you don't know where that trail will lead you. And so that trail um, and many other events has led me here. So I'm so happy to be with you guys and continue to let me know your recipe requests. He has given me the grace for this um, and I do enjoy it. So I will talk to you guys next time and goodbye.